All right, uh, there's a new drama called uh, Water Wings that was made by two local filmmakers. And it's about a man addicted to drugs who loses his fiance and then visits a childhood friend to kind of reboot his life. Take a look. <laughs> anybody for help in my life. Me neither. I need to be my own significant other for a while. I need to take care of myself, my own feelings. Uh, you will recognize the uh, the scenery and um, perhaps not the style, though, of how this film was shot. And to talk to us about a really unusual project, uh, the co-directors, John O'Wells and Justin a Adams, joining us this morning. Good to see you guys. Both San Diegans? You. Yes. So you've been here for a long time. It, you do, you've do you done film work, independent films, industrial work mm -hmm. for, what, how many years? Uh, since I was a kid. So, so this is a lifelong passion for sure. you. And, and Justin, what about you? Me as well, yeah. Now, let's get to the unique aspect of this, because we, we get some great independent films, you know, done here in San Diego, some interesting people, but w what is the process about this that makes it different? It, it's a whole different kind of genre of film, or style of film. What's it called again? Um, this is experimental narrative. Okay, so it's, this is totally unscripted. Uh, correct. So yeah. you, how do you start this process? Uh, well, we wrote like a 15-page outline and casted the movie and uh, basically improvised all the dialogue. So we had certain beats and story notes that we were moving towards. Um, so we'd improvise and kind of, kind of move the story along, you know. But there, isn't there isn't there a genre of film that this is kind of spun off of? As I was reading through the press kit, and I just can't think of the. Uh, people uh, have used mumblecore. For mumblecore, that's what it was. Um, for films that are similar, but we're trying to uh, trying to do something. But new. this is this is different, and I guess that's the point I wanted to make. Is even mm -hmm. for something that uh, that very few people have heard of, this is even more unique than that. Trying to be. Well, what also is very interesting about this is it's not like you started with no story idea. Right. This is based on Justin's life. This is your right. life. Yeah. Justin Adams, this is your <laughs> life. <laughs> yeah, it was kind of uh it was kind of a strange experience to be an actor and and acting as myself, but that's kind of why we chose to go that route. Um because I was playing myself and the improvisation of the of the scenes and everything was came more naturally. Mm -hmm. Um but it was kind of a difficult thing to do, like to push through and, and kind of put myself out there uh, in a sense, like this is my life, this is what happened to me. So you really went through a period of addiction and then recovery and you lost your fiance yep. during that time. Yep. So that, that part of the story is absolutely real. The soundtrack, incredible. Mm -hmm. uh, you, you got some, some folks to help you out here and, mm -hmm. uh, and contribute some amazing music from how many different bands? I think we got uh, 18 bands and ended up using 14 of them. Really, really, really cool stuff. Um, where do you, what do you hope happens with a project that is as unique and different as this? I mean, do you hope that it finds commercial success, or is it something that is it's just a, a labor of love, or do you hope to, you know, somewhere down the road it leads to something else? People yeah. always wonder that about independent filmmakers. We made this film for sale. Um, this is, you know, we're aggressively submitting to festivals and hoping for distribution. Very good. So that's kind of the way that a lot of these independent films work, is you submit to festivals and then hopefully you get a buyer at the festival to approach you and you can sell it from there. Well, let's talk about the, uh, the screening we've got coming up. It's Saturday, June the 13th, 1 o'clock, the La Paloma Theater up on Encinitas. And then uh, you guys will be there for Q&A afterwards right. and be able to talk to the audience about this. So I hope folks will come out and see uh, Water Wings. Again, very unique project, very interesting. And uh, I wish both of you a lot of success. Thank you. Thanks so much for coming in. Thanks Thank a lot. You. Great to see you. All right, again, uh, go to uh, sandiego6.com and click on Hot Topics for more information about the screening for Water Wings.